Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, um, well, a lot of people are, you know, from time to time saying that they're kind of frustrated that they can't move on from Windows uh, 11 22H2 to 23H2, which is the latest version. Um, and wondering why it's not showing up, of course. And one of the things that we know is the famous Copilot seems to be in some cases, um, a little, uh, the, the major problem basically, uh, it's buggy and it is what makes 23H2 not appear for a lot of people. Now, um, the thing is, there's a fix coming apparently, and we could maybe get it this month. And the fix of course, uh, will be for multiple things, including the icons jumping around on multiple screens, but other little fixes that have to do with Copilot. So could that mean that starting in maybe March with the uh, patch Tuesday of next month, uh, when all of this starts moving out, maybe the uh, blockers will be removed. Um, but for now, yes, for those that don't have it, uh, there are still a lot of blockers for 23H2 on Windows 11, and so a lot of people are not seeing it. Um, you know, I do get the, should I force it from time to time? I don't think forcing it for most people will create any issues, but then again, there's a reason why you don't see it, and that reason is that they think that maybe it's better not. So, you know, I would just recommend that you wait at some point it will show up, but um, you know, just have to wait until it does. You still have up to uh, October, October, and November before we get to 24H2, before we have to absolutely move on from 22H2 to 23H2. So, uh, you know, this is not a, a urgent problem for now. And once again, most of the new features were issued before 23H2. So most of the features are there. It, 23H2 will not add much to it. So, um, you know, you just, just wait. I think it's the best thing to do. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.